Hiya everyone, today I'm going to be doing a lucky dip and I hope it turns out lucky because I haven't had a good start. I went to find all my brushes in, the, in a big black L'Oreal bag and I've lost it. I don't know where it is. I've searched high and low and I'm kind of laughing here because of the funniness of it all but I feel like crying because it had all my makeup brushes in and, and uh, I've only got one set left and I didn't want to use them because I wanted to keep them all special but I've lost all my makeup brushes. I can't find them and there's loads of makeup in there as well. So I feel a little bit like crying. I don't want to do this video. <laughs> I hope this turns out nice. I've got all my stuff laid out. I'm going to turn you around now and we're going to do a lucky dip. Hope you enjoy it. Right, we're going to go dive into this one. We're going to go in the palettes. Hope this turns out right because I'm not in the mood for some horrible colours. But never mind. So. Oh, what we got? It's a Lancome. Oh, 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 look at that. Some yellow, some silver, some black, and some white. Get in. Right, okay. I'm a little bit happier now. Right, we're going to go in here, Collection 2000 Barry M and all that. Oh, oh, I like green. 79, light green. Oh, I'm excited. I think the day is redeeming itself, but then again, we haven't done the rest. Right, I'm going to get a blush. Something blushy. What's this one here? Sunset Coral. Oh, God, God. Oh, that's bright. Okay, there I am. Hello. That's going to be all right. Put that there. We'll get some lip gloss now. Right, hang on. They're all going to fall on the floor, aren't they? I've got some books to show you. I hope I remember because I always forget to do stuff. Oh, what's this? Revlon. Nice, like a lip, like a pale pink. That'll do. That'll be all right. Right, now we're going in here just in case we need some colour back up. I'm really happy so far. Wishful. Oh, okay. That's not offensive. That's all right. That'll work. I can put that under my brow. Now we're going in, there's my little remote for the machine. Um, we're going in with the lipsticks. I'm sorry they're all matte ones. I can't find the other box when the other ones in the minute. Wait. What's this one? No. That's going to be all right. Yes, I'm over the moon with that. Good, good, good. I just hope I find my brushes. I could cry. Never mind. So we're going to some pigments. Might not even get round to using all this, but we'll see. What's that one? Ooh, copperized. Ooh, this is going to be a good look. I can just tell. Right, I'm over the moon. Right. Right, here we go. Before I start, because I'm going to forget, I've got some books. I'm not, I'm not affiliated, by the way. So don't, don't worry about that. But I'd read, someone mentioned Medical Medium on one of my last videos. And I went to have a look at him. And he's got books out. And he was all about thyroid. And he reckons it's to do with the Epstein-Barr virus. I'm not completely sure I believe everything. And it's funny because when I'm reading it, I've got all this going on in my head. But I've read so far, it's very interesting does make a lot of sense there's little things that don't sit with us i don't i don't know i'm very it's very interesting book and um i think if it is true it's pretty sinister and i think a lot of the illness it does actually make a lot of sense to why we're quite ill and like we never used to be but um i would i would advise get it have a read if see what you think there's another one, Medical Medium, that's the first one. I've just got them all. I always do this. And Liver Rescue. And it's got loads of different ones, autoimmune disease. There's so much of it about. I've actually got antibodies, so I'm fighting something as well. And he reckons that it's not... Because I got told by my doctor that I've got antibodies attacking my thyroid. My body's attacking my thyroid. But your body doesn't attack itself, and I've always known that. It doesn't sit right with me. And he says it in the book, your body's not attacking itself, it's attacking a pathogen, or in that case, an Epstein-Barr virus. And we'll probably all come across it at some point. 
if you get like a sore throat and you feel down, well that's the Epstein-Barr virus apparently. So it does make a lot of sense and a lot of people are actually quite ill after they've had a bout of what they would call like a cold. So I don't know, but I'm really enjoying it and there's loads of things in there but I just want to genuinely help myself. Went to the doctors, I got my bloods done again and my ferritin's shot up from 22 to 82 so I'm happy about that. And my kidneys are working great again because they were 72, now they're 90 and the range was 90 to 120 so I'm really happy. I do believe that was off getting them blood pressure tablets out of my system because they did drop my kidney function and I haven't had them for ages so I'm over the moon. Me, me thyroid though, my TSH has dropped right down to 1.29 and the, they didn't put the T3 and T4 results on me, me um, copy of results so I'm going to have to go back in and see what they were because that's a bit odd. But anyway, all good, I feel quite positive about where whatever it is is heading and just got to look after yourself haven't you and try not to get stressed. But anyway, I hope this isn't too long for you, I'm already wearing this. I went to the mat counter a couple of months ago and they put that on and it worked so well. I'm not really into foundation, I don't wear it that often but I'm having to because my skin is disgusting and I think it's like a catch 22 because once you put stuff on, you're putting chemicals on your skin, you're going to get more problems and so now I'm having to wear foundation and um, concealer, I was going to say foundation and fabric conditioner, I don't know what, right anyway. Okay, so let's go. I'm actually excited about this look because it's a nice one. It looks like it could work out very well. So first of all, I'm going to go in with some yellow. Yellow. I'm going in with yellow. But I've lost all my brushes, so I'm really sad. I'm using this one here. Martin's mom got us a Ted Baker set for Christmas. And I love it that I'm using the mascara out of it and the eyelash curlers and use a little brush out of it here. So off we go. I'm putting that yellow one all over. I've been drinking um, celery juice. It's a massive fad on internet. And I've got to be honest, I am quite fatty. I am. Me and Martin were laughing about that last night because I go through phases where I'll say, right, I need to eat grapefruit and I'll buy like a box of grapefruit and then I don't really fancy it anymore and it goes mouldy. And um, and then I'll say things like, right, I want to have really expensive raw organic honey and then I'll buy a hundred jars of it and then it just gets sat there. I'm shocking. But I'm, 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 very, I'm very like that. My mum is as well. And I, I've just, it's, it's happening more and more and more, to be honest. So, yes, every morning I've been getting up early and I've been juicing a whole bunch of celery because that's what the internet says you have to do. There's loads of people doing it and they said it makes them feel amazing. I've got to admit, since I started doing it, I've had no neck and shoulder pain and I suffer terrible. I don't know what it is. It could be just a change in the weather. It could be, it could be anything, but it has happened so and it does meant afterwards I read it was anti-inflammatory so you just never know do you right we're gonna go in with some let's see shall we go with the green I'm gonna go with the green now and we'll keep the other colours till the last oh there we go I'll zoom you in so you can see the eyes da, 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 da. look at the skin it's so bad I can't wait to get off this pill not only does it mentally mess with you, and it really mentally messes with you, especially the one I'm on. It's really sad, you know, because they say that a lot of teenagers they go on the pill to get rid of acne um, and regulate their periods and stuff like that. And this one especially has got the, the highest rate of depression, mel mental illnesses, anxiety, suicidal thoughts. That's shocking, you know, if you're completely normal one minute and then you're having them thoughts the next, all because of a um, contraceptive pill, they really want to find out what the hell's in this stuff. But at the minute I have to be on it, but hopefully I'll get to get off it soon. I don't like being on it at all. It's just not good for you. There we go. I'm putting that green on top of the yellow. Looks very... 
flamingo landy. I don't know why I'm saying flamingo land, but because the colours are all tropical. I don't know. It's a very tropical look. Oh dear, have I smashed a glass? No, I haven't. Good, good, good. Because we don't want any more bad luck today, do we? I've got to go and meet my mum soon, so this this is going to have to stay on. <laughs> I better do a good job. Right, we're going to go in with some grey now. So I think what we'll do is, oh, that's a bit too much, Lauren. These brushes, they're not me normal brushes, help. I like me normal brushes. These are too big. I'm going to use a different one. It's massive, I will use that one. Right. I've got some of my brushes here, but some of them, like, these are the long ones. These are the longer tapered ones. I like the shorter tapered ones. And, oh, I can't believe I've lost them. I gave a load of makeup to my twin sisters last time they were here. And I'm even wondering if I'll put it in the bag with their stuff. But I don't know. Have to have a look and if not I'm gonna to have to open the set that I've got left because I kept one all sealed and lovely it's every single brush that I had made and I've kept it in the set it's not being used I'm gonna to have to break that open I think because I can't find them mm, not fair just putting that in the outer corners see it's too big of a brush this for this area especially for a dark color it's okay if I blend in light colors but it's just not for me dark at the minute, I think. It's very light in here. What's that? Someone's got the radio on. Right, a bit more in there. E, I have to cut down. I've been eating Rice Krispie. Jordan's been making us Rice Krispie cake things with protein in, like a rocky road. And I can't stop eating them. But they've got protein powder in and I don't need that stuff because I'm not at the gym. Well, not no, no, I'm not at the gym. So I've been putting a lot of weight on. I'm quite a bit of a porker at the minute. I've got a bit of a belly on us. But you know what? At least I'm on it. I'm keeping on it. It's just so hard. And when I get to work, the girl I work with is really, really, really slim. She eats loads of donuts, jellies, cakes, crisps, munching on crisps and everything. I kind of do it. I kind of get away with it like them. It's not fair. Never mind. I just can't get away with it. Right. Now I'm going to go in with the black. Ooh. I'm going to go in with the black. It's very sparkly black. Just a little bit here because I don't want too much. Oh God, that is dark. That is very dark. I'm going to have to get rid of that and blend that out. Or shall I leave it? I don't know. I don't want to leave it too much. Now I'm going to blend that out. It's hard for us to, I can't see this side, it's so dark. So I don't know what I've done. So you'll be looking on the camera laughing. But I honestly can't see what I'm doing. Now I need a clean big brush and wolf that out. Get out, it's too much. Oh, that's better. Get that down. It's far too dark. I don't think I'm going to have any room for the pigment now. Have I? That's not even right. I'm just dropping everything on the floor. Oh, help. I was putting all my um, memories away. Because I've got boxes and boxes of it. And we're, Martin bought us some storage boxes for in the attic. So sorting all that out yesterday, or the day before, I was at work yesterday, I was at the day before. Yeah, took ages and I can't even lift the boxes now, they're that heavy. I'm going to put a bit of, where we're putting it? Yeah, get rid of that. Oh, I wish I'd known that was the all along. I'm going to put a little bit of Wishful right under the eyebrow bone to give it a bit of a highlight. That's alright. Actually we'll get in the inner corner and get a bit highlight. Can't see what I'm doing. It's so funny the light in here. Not good when you put makeup on and you've got to go out. 
<laughs> I wonder how orange my foundation is actually now that I'm thinking about it. Oh well, we'll see. My mum's not bothered. She couldn't care. She couldn't care less what I looked like. Right, now, shall I put some Coco Motion on? Is it Coco Motion? No, it's copperized. We're going to put some on just for fun. What have I got? What have I got? What have I got? We'll use that little brush again. Right. There we go. I'm just going off the lid. It's very pigmented. I'm going to put a little bit, it's not even picking up, come on, a little bit on there, about the corner. It's added a little bit of um, gold to the black, so that's nice. Yeah, I don't have time to take this off. I've got to literally put it on and get out of here. I'm always late for her, bless her. She puts up with a lot of me. I will say, Mom, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'll be there for 12. And then one o'clock. I'm on my way because I like to walk as well when I'm on a day off. Right, right, right. Anyway, my eyes are done. Let's get them curled. Oh, look. New, new curlers. They're out the Ted Big. I said, so Carol, if you're watching, thank you. I am using it all. It's lovely. And the mascara's nice as well. And I'm, I'm a one mascara person, but this is actually really nice. I'll get them curled up. Oh. I would put some um, liner on, but because I'm in a hurry, it's not going to work, is it? So we won't bother putting that on. And I've got some blush to do and some lipstick. Please don't let us forget. <laughs> okay. Oh, right, they're up. Okay, we'll go. Give these a good squeeze. Mm -mm -mm. It's funny how when I do this, I go quiet. Right. <coughs> I feel like I'm losing my voice mad. I'm just getting over a cold as well, which wasn't fun. Ugh. And for the past month, I've been really warm. And that's not like me, I'm always freezing. But I've been really warm and I'm wondering if that's because my ferrin's gone up. But it can't be that quick, can it? I really don't know what to be honest. I'm confused.com. So we'll put that on there. Get that on there. I can't see what I'm doing with this eye. Can you even see what I'm doing? I don't even know if you can. Yeah, I'm going to go for a walk. I'm going to walk today. Because I usually get the bus if I'm in a hurry, but I'm just going to walk. I might be a bit late. You know, people say that they're, going, they're late for that one funeral and stuff. I actually think I'm going to be on time for that one. I'm late for everything else, so... I'm shocking. I'm absolutely shocking. Martin hates being late. We're complete opposite in that case. Right. He's just come back as well from... He went away for training for work. That was horrible without him. And I know he's going to be watching this. It was horrible. But he knows this because I've told him. I've lost my blush I brush. I don't even know where it is. I'm going to have to use this foundation brush which is not going to be oh it might work actually oh that's fine a little bit there so we're going in with that it's lovely this nice touch of pink to go with the green and yellow it's actually not a bad look this is a lucky dip could have went a lot worse <laughs> I'm happy with it that's that on now we'll get some lipstick on so we're going in with myrrh mm -hmm. Itchy nose. Hmm. I'll get you zoomed back out. You don't need to be that close now. Don't you know? Ooh. Get some funny customers at work. Because they invade your privacy. They sidle right up to you really close. And I'm always worried because I eat a lot of garlic and I'm always worried about my breath. And so I have to keep away from them. <laughs> but they don't seem they don't seem bothered, so it mustn't smell too much. I said to Martin yesterday, right, well, I've got nice steaks for a lunch, like for a dinner, because it's Valentine's Day. He bought us the best card I've ever had. He put photos on it from Moonpig and mine was off the shelf, shop bought, and I felt really bad. <laughs> 
I do feel really bad. But it's a nice one. But his is lovely. His has had so much thought put into it. He's definitely staying. And lovely flowers. And there was chocolates in there as well. There's only five. So I scoffed all of them. Yes. Right. I think I'm done. And I actually quite like this look. It's nice and fresh. And I've got to go to the gym now as well. I'm meeting him at the gym. So I need to make sure I pack me trainers. I've got loads to think about before I leave the house here. And loads to clean up as well because you want to see the tip in front of us. I was looking through everything for your bushes. I kind of find them. Right, I'm going to have to go because I've got lots to do. And I don't get many days off to get it done. It feels like you just don't get enough time to live. But I'm always at work. Oh, always at work. Good job I like the place because honestly... But I do. I love my job. Right, viewers, I have to go. I shall see you all in a bit. I really, really hope you've enjoyed. Leave us comments. Let us know how you are getting on. And I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Zoom, zoom.